Last updated 2204 the 21st of April 2018 Getty Images Sean Kenny Dowell scores a late try to grab the win for the Knights on Saturday. Rugby League A 79th minute try to Sean Kenny Dowell has given Newcastle a stunning 22-20 comeback win over the West's Tigers to move into the NRL Top 8. The Tigers were leading by two points late on Saturday when Jamie Burr, with Mitchell Pierce off the field with concussion, kicked for Kenny Dowell in the corner to steal a miracle victory. It appeared the Knights had wasted a 10-point halftime lead when the Tigers came out of the sheds and scored three tries in five minutes to surge to an 18-10 lead. But a last-ditch play from Burr gave the Knights their fourth win of the season, and also ended the Tigers' winning streak at three in dramatic circumstances. Redmore, asterisk Burgess Powers Souths to win asterisk Manly Skipper fined for clashes asterisk Manly Prodigy demoted after bust-ups asterisk Cherry Evans faces sanctions after incidents asterisk Warriors can get better Knights winger Ken Seo was an unlikely hero in front of the 10,082 crowd in Tamworth, finishing with his first career hat-trick to save the goal-kicking blemishes of star fullback Callan Ponga. Ponga's wayward kicking appeared to have cost them the two points after converting just one of five attempts before Kenny Dowell's heroics. The win lifted Newcastle back into the top eight on four wins. The Tigers missed an opportunity to join St. George Illawarra and the Warriors at the top of the table and remained in fourth spot. Knights had the upper hand at halftime after a solid opening 40 minutes, beginning with Ponga's sublime cutout for Co to draw first blood in the 21st minute. Knights forward Lachlan Fitzgibbon fumbled an opportunity not long after, but concussion tests for Jacob Little and Benji Marshall paved the way for more shots at the Tigers line. And Pierce didn't need a second invitation, slicing through in the 34th minute to give the Knights a 10-point lead at the break. Marshall's return immediately paid dividends for the hosts, with the reborn playmaker bombing for Kevin Nakama and chipping for Corey Thompson to give his team the advantage. But the Knights pulled one back with Fitzgibbon's cutout for Co, before finding a way to cross the line late and take another step in their improved season. Add feedback.